Welcome to Streamline News for Wednesday, March 16th, 2011, brought to you by SwimOutlet.com, the web's most popular swim shop. The worst kept secret in swimming right now is officially out of the bag. Ian Thorpe finally confirmed yesterday that he is indeed moving to Switzerland to train under coach Gennady Turetsky in his comeback quest for a spot on the Australian Olympic team. Thorpe has been swimming in the United Arab Emirates for the past three weeks, and since then, sources have told the media that Thorpe was intending to train with Turetsky, but Thorpe never confirmed it. Now, Thorpe has said he and Turetsky will work together for the next 15 months or so in Switzerland, with occasional trips back to Australia. Turetsky is most famous for guiding the great Alex Popoff to four Olympic gold medals in the 1500 freestyles in 1992 and 1996, and was the head coach at one of Australia's training centers that included not only Popoff, but Olympic champions Michael Clem and Patria Thomas. Swimming World TV producer Garrett McCaffrey is in Orlando, Florida for the NCSA Junior National Championship, where he will be bringing you the finals live on SwimmingWorld.tv. Two swimmers have already begun their quest to be the top names to come out of this meet. In the 1,000-yard freestyle last night, Daniel Thompson of Hensdale Swim Club won with an 8.55.72, a very fast time, ahead of Clay Youngquist, who is likely to win several events this week. On the women's side, Allison Hosley took over the top longtime reign of Nova teammate Rachel Narath, winning with a quick 9.39.30. You can see interviews with Thompson and Halsey on the Junior Nationals event page at SwimmingWorld.tv. Also Swimming World yesterday was AquaJet star Rachel Bootsma, who led off the girls' 200 medley relay with a 24.02 backstroke. Today's prelims are complete in Orlando, and Kevin Cordes put up an amazingly fast 100 breaststroke, leading the field with a 53.68. And just a couple of weeks ago at the Illinois State High School Championships, Cordes swam a 54.1. Just for the record, the national high school record is 5366, and unfortunately, Cordes cannot break that record at this meet. Again, we will bring you live finals coverage starting at 6 p.m. Eastern on SwimmingWorld.com and SwimmingWorld.tv. That's it for today's edition of Streamline News. Thanks for watching.